Hi, I'm Bill Shannon, and I'm here today to talk about Meco Shade hardware and as it relates to competitive products. It's really important to note that the difference between Meco Shade parts and pieces and most of the competition is really quite dramatic. And I'm going to go through some of the parts and pieces and let you know so that you're really aware of what the differences are. First of all, we start with the, the uh, brackets. The Meco Shade bracket is made of galvanized steel and Delrin, which is a space age material, composite material, that is incredibly durable. It's used in manufacturing airplane parts and pieces and so forth. So it's a very, very durable product. And you'll notice that both brackets, the, the bracket with the clutch and the other end, both have galvanized steel brackets with the Delrin components on it. Also, the sprocket on the Meco Shade hardware has 90 pound test stainless steel chain. Now the chain could be stronger than 90 pounds, but we really don't want it to be stronger than 90 pounds because if there's more than that much pressure on the chain, it could end up pulling the shade out of the ceiling. So you want the chain to break before you pull a ceiling part down. So that's really important. Now compare that with the hardware in a number of the competitors in the marketplace. A simple piece of plastic with a light gauge uh, chain, and, but if you look at the, the plastic component compared to the MECO component, it's strikingly different. And this is what you're getting if you accept an alternate to MECO shade in many instances. Now the other thing that's important is when you look at the tube of the Meco Shade material. We have an extruded aluminum tube with a snap lock uh, fabric feature so that the tube is, uh, once the, um, the shade is fabricated and installed in the tube, it has to be straight and it has to be true. It can't be put, installed incorrectly. Furthermore, if for any reason in the future you want to change the fabric, it simply can be disengaged from the tube and a new piece of fabric put on. So it makes it really easy. Now, a lot of the competitors' products have really interesting tubes. For example, this manufacturer with the plastic end piece has a bent metal tube and the fabric is fastened to the tube utilizing two-sided tape and staples. Now obviously this is a lot lower quality than you'll find with a Meco Shade product. But it's important for you to know this. And it's also important for you to know that when these components are slid into the tube, this is strictly a friction fit. Whereas the Meco tube is extruded with, part, with a shape to it that locks the motor and locks the sprocket into the tube so that it can't slide. That's really, really important. Also, when you look at the fascia pieces that go on some of the shading systems, the Meco fascia is an extruded aluminum snap-on piece of material. A lot of the competitors use bent metal and various other parts and pieces for their fascia material. Now, one of the things to really keep in mind when we talk about all these parts and pieces when somebody comes to you and says, well, I have a substitution for the Meco Shade product on your job, and I'll save you some money. The interesting thing that we've discovered, we've looked at many jobs of different sizes, but if you look on a $20 million project, usually the shade contract for the specified Meco Shade will be $100,000 or $125,000, depending upon how many uh, motor-operated shades there are. The savings to go to this, obviously, substandard product is generally less than fifteen or twenty thousand dollars and this is on a twenty million dollar building so what are you really saving on probably one of the most used uh, components of your building people are putting shades up and down all day every day of their lives and if you have a substandard product chances are you're going to have a problem and the other thing to keep in mind is the Meco uh, sprocket has a self-lubricating uh, system built into it. So this keeps it smoothly operating. And when you look at a warranty, I think the warranty says it all. They, 
the MECA warranty is life of the use warranty uh, be based upon the products in use on this particular job. The other people generally offer about a five-year warranty, so the difference is astounding. MECA was also, for those of you who aren't familiar with it, basically the developer of this whole industry. So they've been doing this a long, long time, and Shannon Corporation has represented them since the early 1980s. So we've been involved with MECO for many, many years. And I think if you really look at your project and really look at the parts and pieces and be sure if somebody's trying to substitute that you get the parts and pieces and compare them to the MECO parts and pieces, you'll find that it's not a really valuable uh, change that you're making for your project and probably a mistake. If you have any questions, please call Shannon Corporation and talk to one of us or go to shannoncorporation.com which is hot linked to the Mecco Shade uh, website. We also have project details and project photographs for your information. So we really look forward to working with you on your next project. Thank you very much.